Uh, this chart here is one of my favorite charts. So a lot of people think that flamenco is really one style of music, but it actually isn't. Uh, flamenco is an umbrella term. There are actually over 50 different palos, and a palo means a style of flamenco. If you translate palo, literally, it means a branch or a stick on a tree, because we like to think of flamenco as a big tree with all these branches that come off of it. So all of these here are different palos of flamenco, and all of them sound different. They come from different regions of Spain, or they come from uh, different emotions and different gypsy uh, peoples at the time. So they all sound different. For example, let's say I want to play this one right here. This is called Segadias. Segadias is one of the more ancient styles of flamenco. It talks about, uh, it's one of the darkest ones as well. It talks about death and persecution of the gypsies. And if I play it, it sounds like this. to alegrias, and the word alegrias literally means joy or happiness in Spanish. And if I play that one, it sounds like this. So really contrasting emotions, right? We have a really deep, dark, depressing style of flamenco, and then we have a really uplifting, happy uh, style. So it all depends on where in Spain it came from and the people that played it. And some of these as well are also um, only played at certain times of the year. For example, up here we have um, Campanilleros and Biancicos. Those are actually uh, flamenco style Christmas carols that are only played during the Navidad and Christmas time. So really 50 different styles. So we have quite a variety in flamenco.